G'day legends, we're back. Today we've got a special from Transite. As you can see here, not a new box, it's a bit second handy, but got a new board to play with. So I'm gonna get straight into this, do an unboxing, um, so you can see what's in it. It is, I believe, an all-wheel drive, direct drive, similar to what I've had, but I'm hoping it's gonna be the full carbon. So let's get stuck into this bad boy and actually think, I've already cut the tape off, so I speed up things a little bit. Can't see me now because I'm going to get covered in box because I'm short. Here goes nothing. I can't see anything anyway. I'll give you a quick gander inside the box. A quick look inside. Box of peripherals. Yep, I'll put that down here. There is some wheels in here. And I've got to say, 150 by 50 Hota wheels. These are the Hota treads. So these are, I've been told, I haven't ridden on this tire yet, but I've been told these are absolutely amazing. So we've got a set of these to run on the all-wheel drive, direct drive, so, and it is an all-wheel drive, direct drive. I haven't unwrapped it yet. And we're gonna have to lift this board out of here, and it's wrapped, so bear with me. Oh my God, sorry, oh my goodness, it's so heavy. Oh, from this end. Watch, I have to chuck this on the scales. And... Wow, that was elegant. Not. The carbon fibre top. And... Oh my lord. Whoa. This is absolutely beautiful, people. My, whoa. Whoa! Stop the presses. This has got the Transite wings on it as well. So for those extra bit of wool, I'll lift this up and give you a bit of a, a bird's eye view. We've got the Transite wings actually on the side of the board here. So this deck has been grown considerably. I'll put this up against my other all-wheel drive bamboo Behind me, I'll put this up against so you can see the size difference in the actual dimensions of deck according to my feet and so forth. But this is absolutely beautiful. I I cannot tell you, I honestly can't say, express how nice this deck is. It is absolutely glorious. So what he's done, Eduardo's done here, he's he actually covered the full pad here with padded um, deck tape. Or, like dope grip, I suppose it is. Um, he's put it all the way on the wings here and he's left and left the wings exposed here and he's actually shown, just put the um, hexagon shaped over this so you can actually still see the wing on there. So he's done two different so we can see the differences. So a couple of quick differences I see already. Obviously we've got the 3D printed gasket here, which is quite big. I'll lean it just up a little bit higher so you can see it. You can see the transite just in there. It is, looks really, really neat. The other thing is, is the start or power button is over here. So you've got power on the front edge corner of the board, obviously, sorry, back end, transite directions, follow the arrow. This is the back of the board. So there's the uh, power on button down here. Obviously, um, Eduardo and the boys, or the crew at Transite have put the, the red soft guards on here, vented guards, which are 3D printed as well, to allow, get nice cooling around that. This is a bigger battery. This is bigger than everything uh, and much higher in board than the original all-wheel drive, direct drive prototype that I was lucky enough to ride on. So I'll go out and do a bit of a ride. I'll give you the specs of the board while I'm out riding and go through the details so you can see them. And I'm gonna be really careful of this one. No scratches, Craig, no scratches, because it is exquisite as you've already seen. Um, all right. The magic box. Trusty knife. Just quickly nick through the transite tape there. La 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 la! God! Oh! So, straight up, 
charger cable for the remote I'm gathering right in there. It must have slipped through. Um, the man has given me a whole heap of Transite stickers for my sticker boards and everything else that I roll. As you all know, I love my stickers. An abundance here, so I'll have to give some of those out. Charger. Oh, he's got a different charger. So, this is different. This is unique. This is a Yui one. So this is similar to the ones that I've seen some of the LaCroix guys um, in their backpacks um, just for fast charging when they're out. It is a... So it's a 4 amp, four amp charger. So 4 amps, good. The man has thrown everything in here. A couple of Transite key rings. I think these are all 3D printed as well. They look like they're 3D printed. How awesome is that? So it's some, it's some, some stuff in here. All right, where's the remote? Oh, hang on a minute, there it is. All right, as you can see, proper Transite remote. Same as the one I've previously used, and I love this remote, it is beautiful. My mate Tom just got one for another one of his boards. Um, absolutely sensational, there you go. Standard remote, I'll go through the workings of that next time I go out for a ride, so. What can I say? Let's just get out there and ride this board and I can tell you more about it while I'm out riding. Sweet. So here I am, where am I? Here I am at the, on, out on the uh, Transite all-wheel drive direct drive. It is the production board with the carbon fibre coloured in red. Um, it is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to fling you around this way so you can see the board. It's absolutely glorious and all of its absolute exquisite shininess. Man, it's the sec one of the sexiest boards I've seen. Full with wings and everything. It is absolutely glorious. So, right now we're going to get out there and do some, do some runs on it and just see how she goes and um, see how she compares. As you know, I did the prototype video. You can see the link up here um, and all my reviews on that. This is a production board with the full carbon fibre top, which is a limited edition. So, if you're going to want it, if you want the carbon fibre edition, get into it and get into it quick. I'll walk through the stats and stuff later um, on the board, so stick with us so we can go through those. Right today, it's been wet and miserable out in Melbourne, so I'm just going to give you a bit of a run and um, try and avoid all the wet areas and just have some fun, do a little bit of carving. They're running, whoa, so first up, one thing I've got to tell you, the uh, wings on this make it so much more manoeuvrable than without. Those wings give you that lock-in feeling where you can really deeply dig into it. I tell you what, little movements give you that so much more maneuverability. So I think it's going to be a thing that's going to really pay off dividends for uh, Transite, those wings. But I tell you what, have a look at this board. It is glorious. Really small movements give you that dig-in car feeling. Not going fast, just doing 15, 20k an hour, just playing. The acceleration on this board is, I can feel already, is far superior than the other one. Oh, it's very wet here. Promised Transite I wouldn't take this board out in dirt and stuff, but because it is one of their more expensive boards with all the, all the details on it. But I tell you what, straight up, acceleration is really quick. Oh, there's some water on the tracks everywhere around here and some mud. Oh, just slicking off, moving around a bit. It is very, it's got a good compression in this board. This deck is really nice. I'll flick you around here so you can see. As you can see, the board is really, it's so nice. Wow. And this, these Hoda, Hoda toy, tires, Hoda tires, are a good addition. I'm just going to break because I'm coming into the window section. I'll stop you here. So one thing you just need to be a bit mindful of, there's a lot of traffic around today, so thank you. A lot of, a lot of traffic around today. Everyone's getting out and about. The weather is down here in Melbourne for the last week and two has been absolutely atrocious get you a bit more of a look on that board. That red nearly looks orange to be quite honest. Oh, 
Those little twitchy movements make this board feel so fast. And I tell you what, I'm only just getting into the throttle, doing 40k an hour, and I'm literally just warming up. Woo! So if you're a brave person, you can really scream along with this board if you wanted to. Tell you what, Jesus, fun. Look, garbage on the road or tracks. Just gotta watch out for all these wet areas. These Hoda tires are really hanging on, they're really grippy, really nice. <laughs> oh, you can feel the board moving. These, it's just too wet for these tyres to hang on. Sorry, Eduardo. Sorry, Transite. I will clean the board up and make it beautiful before I send it back to you. I promise. It's just damp under the wheels. Woo! You can feel the board. You can feel that slide out a little bit. quiet this board no screaming motors it's like surfing straight down the face of a wave Whew. oh oh it's got those brakes are awesome so much control obviously with the direct drive just jumping on those stoppers and feeling all the braking just holding me up beautifully We'll test them out again a little bit later, but just give those brakes a bit of a crack. Just trying to make sure I don't get the board too wet and also run it through bloody big deep water because that's the last thing I want to do is damage a beautiful board like this. So here we go. Let's crank it back up again. Whoa, jeez, we're flying. You, come on. So much more left in and I'm only just getting on it now. We're climbing up a hill. Oh, look at that water. All right. Oh. This thing has got some serious torque, some serious acceleration. It is a hungry board. It wants to go. It just wants to keep going. So, um, yeah, we'll check the speeds before, but I'll, um, after the fact. But I tell you what, it's got some meat behind that. Phew. Loving it. Absolutely loving it. Right, so back to my testing hill. I haven't been down here for a long time. Gotta get my foot position in a little bit. I've driven the all-wheel drive direct drive before down here without the wings and so forth and not the and the prototype. So this is a production board and I just want to give it a crack down here. Oh, you can feel that board just hanging on. Those wings, you really got to be mindful because you do have so much more extra turning capacity and the smallest micro movements allow you to feel where the board really wants to dig in and where it wants to go to. So just be mindful if you're getting wings. Makes a big difference to the board. Oh, such a great, great bit of kit. Oh, so nice. All right, to give you a bit of a rundown on this board, it is a Roadster all-wheel drive, direct drive from Transite. It comes with two different battery options. That's right, two different battery op options. Um, they're both built, built with MolyCell 2700P42A batteries. Um, and the first one is a 12S4P, um, which is 725 watt hours. And then you can upgrade to a 12S6P, which is 1,090 watt hours. The battery is absolutely awesome. It's built by local builders in Australia and you couldn't get a better built battery anywhere in the market. 
So good. Uh, finding my happy place again, as we all do when we get out there on the wheels and start skating. It's been a couple of weeks because of all the bad weather, but I tell you what, back in my happy place. You look at that. Creek's full, water's flowing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And the track is wet. A little bit of run down here. All right, now let's go on to the other side of things. Wheels, you can run AT200s, AT150s, which are the Hoda wheels, which you saw in the video. Um, rubber 115s, the hard rubber ones, and as well as cloud wheel 120s. So to get out of, for example, the 12S6P <laughs> like this board, you're going to be able to get about 75 oh, kilometer so range power, with so the cloud fun. 120s. Um, with the 150s that I ran on it, um, we all, the range is expected to be about 50 kilometers. So on the Transite website, you can go over and have a look at their score. They've actually scored all the different tires on this board, so you can actually get an idea of what is the best. Um, they're actually giving a rating for the AT150s at 19 out of 20 as an overall score. And the rubber, hard rubber 115s, um, also at a 19. The uh, AT200s uh, and cloud 120s, fall slightly below that but that's probably much more a comfort ride than anything else but really good ratings um, the it is a vest board as i've always originally said in the original video um, it is with a vx2 remote the remote is fantastic it's a really one of my favorite remotes out there um, the bat the deck is a bamboo maple um, mid to mid stiff flex deck um, dimensions of this is 98.7 centimeters by 23.7 centimeters um, with a max foot area of 21.6 centimeters. Obviously, that's a standard deck. That's not with the wings on it, so it goes a bit bigger than that. So one of my favorite little areas to come through. Hopefully it's not too wet. Whoa, I can see the water on the trails. Oh, and mud and dirt. Oh God, sorry about this guys, it's a mess. Now, I'm not gonna take this too fast because usually when it's dry, you can fly through here. Oh, but it is seriously wet and messy. So, as you are, as you'd expect. Ooh. Wow, this talk on this board is ridiculous. All right limited edition carbon fusion decks. You can option this board up and actually have the carbon just like this. It is a beautiful bit of kit and you won't be disappointed if you get the carbon. It is, it makes the board absolutely Whoa. glorious and um, I am what very, very happy and today. very fortunate to clean up and ride this board. It is absolutely beautiful. Um, so that's it for the specs, get back to the ride, let's go. As you can see, the turning circle on this is absolutely beautiful. Really, really nice. The carving of this board is just magnificent. Nice turn radius, really sharp, really carvy, and a hell of a lot of fun. Whew. So nice. Good combination of good quality tyres, high quality board, well made, precision everything, those wings just add another dimension to this board and I gotta say I'm so damn impressed with it, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful.
there you go, Transite all-wheel drive, direct drive, carbon fiber um, in red, motor guards in red. This thing is ridiculously nice. Super, super, super fast, a lot of fun. It gave me a lot of thrills. I've got to say, comfort factor is really, really high on this board. Having the wings on there, um, I'm going to talk a bit, mo bit more about those and give you a bit of some measurements and stuff in another video coming up, so stay tuned for that one. Um, but this board is absolutely beautiful. With these 150mm um, Hoda wheels, beautiful grippy tyres, um, a lot of fun, and um, I can't speak highly enough. The guys at Transite have done an absolute exquisite job of this board. It is absolutely beautiful, and um, as you can see, over here, we've still got the original prototype is with me. Um, so I'm gonna do some measurements and give you some deck sizing to see how big these wings are and, and just explain me a bit more about the wings. Other than that, love it, love it, love it, love it. If you're thinking about it, don't hesitate, pull the trigger, get this board. It is absolutely magnificent. And um, wings, stay tuned for another video soon. Anyway, stay upright, keep smiling. Craig Taylor out.